One of the greatest things that can happen to you or to me is to be transformed. To be looking like the same person, but all new. You know what I'm talking about. All new from inside out. A whole new mind, a whole new body, a whole new life, a whole new career. I've seen people transformed. I've seen people come out of prayer, come out of a spiritual experience. One of our spiritual retreat cruises caused this to happen in several. And they were totally changed. Never the same again. Everything was better. In Isaiah 26, verses 8 and 9, it says this, O Lord, my spirit within me earnestly seeks you. Well, when you do this, when you go towards God with everything, your whole life change, changes. There is a story of a missionary that was in in Africa, and they were taking an offering after a lesson. And they had straw baskets, and one woman that was in the congregation put the basket down on the ground and stood in it. Now, they thought that the woman didn't know what she was doing, but the woman did. She was giving her whole self to God, and that is what we must do. I pray that the power of God transforms you and affects all that you think, you say, and you do. In order to change what is happening to you or what is happening through you, you take a close look at what is happening within you. Your attitudes, your thoughts, your beliefs are what eventually come from you as words and actions. And even deeper within you, there is a power that, when used, will infuse all that you think, you say, and you do with patience and with love and with understanding. It is the power of God within that is the starting point of being that loving person, that transformed person that you desire to be. And then all that you say and you do is not forced by a, a feeling of responsibility, duty, or loyalty, but done out of a pure and an absolute joy of letting the power of God surge through you to transform you in the way that you have been touched and you have been permanently changed. And it also transforms others in the way that you interact with them. I pray today that the power of God transforms you and it affects all that you say and you do and you think. God bless you.